Look at the goaltenders, Mike Gwen. Here we go. Brent Johnson with DP Enzo. I want to see it. Here we go. Oh, hit him with a lefty oh. puck. No, he hit him. He hit him. He's not going to hit him again. But he's going he's to hold him down and don't let him up. Well, he, he hammered him good. John Van Beesbrook, or the Beezer as he was called, started his career in the OHL with the Sioux Greyhounds and was quickly drafted in the 1981 NHL entry draft in the fourth round, 72nd overall, by the New York Rangers. Van Beesbrook would appear in one game for the Rangers during the 81-82 season, but would spend the rest of his time with the Sioux Greyhounds of the OHL. The same would be for the following season. During the 83-84 season, he would split time between the New York Rangers, appearing in three games, and playing for the Tulsa Oilers of the Central Hockey League. It was during the 84-85 season that Van Beesbrook would make his full-time start with the Rangers, appearing in 42 games that season. It was the following year, however, where he would make it big, appearing in 61 games and having a record of 31 wins, 21 losses. With a goals against average of 3.32 and a save percentage of .887, along with three shutouts, would earn him Vesna Trophy honors that year. Van Beesbrook would play seven more full seasons with the New York Rangers, until the 93-94 season, where he was selected in the expansion draft to the Florida Panthers. Van Beeswerk would spend the next five years playing in Florida as their starting goaltender, and would make it all the way to the Stanley Cup Finals during the 95-96 season, ultimately being swept by the Colorado Avalanche in four games. But despite the sweep, Van Beeswerk would finish third in Conn Smythe Trophy voting. After the 97-98 season, Van Beesbrook would sign a two-year contract with the Philadelphia Flyers. He would put up decent numbers in Philadelphia, but the team could not get it together to make a playoff run. During the 2000 offseason, Van Beesbrook was traded to the New York Islanders for a fourth-round pick in that year's draft. The Islanders wanted Van Beesbrook as they thought that he would be a good mentor for their first overall pick, Rick DiPietro. Van Beesbrook would appear in 44 games that year, only winning 10 and was traded at the deadline to the New Jersey Devils. As they wanted to give Martin Brodeur a break before the playoffs, and Chris Terreri was struggling in net. During that 0102 season, Van Beesburg would start in five games, winning only two of them, and would not start in the playoffs, although the Devils did make it all the way to the Stanley Cup Finals, but would ultimately lose in seven games to the Colorado Avalanche. Van Beesbrook would retire from active play immediately after the Game 7 loss, citing that he wanted to leave the game healthy. He would finish his career playing in 882 NHL games with a goals against average of .298 and a save percentage of .899. He would also record 40 career shutouts, which would tie Hall of Famer Frank Brimzik for the most shutouts by an American-born goaltender in NHL history. He was a three-time NHL All-Star, a Vezina Trophy winner, and was inducted into the United States Hockey Hall of Fame in 2007, and has yet to be inducted into the Hockey Hall of Fame. It's